this is very complicated. What's up, Hog Life Gang, man? It's your boy Muggs, man, back with another Tom McDonald reaction, man. We finally at this house. Another highly requested song outside of Tom vs. Hollow Time. That's probably my favorite video uh, of all time right now. Yeah, this house, outside of um, Greatest Rapper Ever, Best Rapper Ever, this was the most highly requested video right here. Um, definitely give a shout out to everybody who subscribed and press, uh, press hit that like button, man. Shout out to Hog Life Gang. You guys have really pushed the channel up to heights I never thought it was imaginable. And um, so I give my love and I show my love back to you guys and uh, and hit you all up with the request y'all need. So, hey, let's get it. Lately, everyone been talking crazy. Feel like everybody's got some to say. They misinterpreted my good intentions and expected I was just going to step away. If yeah, that's the way it is in America, Tom. People always misinterpret good intentions, man, because they just want to. Say what they want to say. They want to get their point across. This is it's just the way it is, man. Sorry you had to experience that. There's a heart that pumps and there's a breath to take. Then I won't bite my tongue as long as I'm awake and they don't have the guts to make a dumb mistake. I'd rather crash a car than never touch the brakes. I built this. I'd rather crash a car and never touch the brakes. Woohoo. Wow. Tongue as long as I'm awake and they don't have the guts to make a dumb mistake. I'd rather crash a car than never touch the brakes. I built this in house. They're the kind of people that be dying for exposure. They're the kind of people that get mad and lose composure. They're the kind of people that are never going forward. They're just the ones, the ones that are looking for apologies. Hating real loud, but they follow me. Screaming at the top of their lungs. I'm the scum of the earth in the same damn breath trying to preach about equality. Back <laughs> Wait, I didn't catch none of that, bro. That dude, this is a different speed than I'm used to. I'm used to him going rapping fast, but I ain't used to him going this fast. But they get mad and lose composure. They're the Hold I up. built this in house. They're the kind of people that be dying for exposure. They're the they, they the kind of people that be dying for exposure. The kind of people that get mad and lose composure. They're the, mad lose composure. the kind of people that are never going forward. They're forward. just the ones, the ones that are looking for apologies. Hating real loud, but they follow me. Screaming at the top of their lungs. I'm the scum of the earth in the same damn breath. Trying to preach about equality. Uh. Song on race. They all ignored that I had something great. They tried to edge me out. They didn't hear my bars. They tried to tell me that I wasn't built for fame. Fast forward to when I'm paid. I ain't spent a dollar on the f***ing chain. I'll get my mama house. I'll get my dad a car. I'll make my sister rich. She'll never work again. And this uh. hater. Let's get it, man. Y'all hear what he said? Did y'all hear what he said right here? He was talking about uh, people who in the same breath trash him but preach equality, people who don't understand his bars, people who say he can't rap. You know what I'm saying? He's showing them, you know what I'm saying? It's not necessarily, uh, um, I don't know. He's showing them that he don't apologize for what he did. You know what I'm saying? They didn't hear my Apologies, hate real loud, but they follow me. Screaming at the top of their lungs, I'm the scum of the earth in the same damn breath, trying to preach about equality. They screaming at the top of their lungs, screaming at the top of the lungs. He the scum of the earth, but he try to preach about equality, bro. That's that, that resonate with me, bro. I, that, that's the one I really don't understand. Back before I wrote the song on race, they all ignored that I had something great. They tried to edge me out, they didn't hear my bars. They tried to tell me that I wasn't built for fame. Uh, they say ain't trying to build me out, the build me, I wasn't. Uh, <clears throat> Trying to say I wasn't built for fame. Fast forward to when I'm paid. I ain't spent a dollar on the f***ing chain. I'll get my mama house. I'll get my dad a car. I'll make my sister rich. She'll never work again. And Let's this go. It's so underwhelming. I'm conditioned for all the abuse. Seeing the reaction videos all blowing up. And you're welcome for all of the views. Mmm. Hey. Hey. I'm humble with it, bro. I'm humble with it, bro. Your community is building my channel right now. Hey, I'm humble with it. I'm here for it, man. Cause you know he could, you know what I'm saying he could be a real a hole and you know copyright strike all the reaction reaction videos, but he understands that helps him with all the uh with all the views. You know what I'm saying he's in with all the reaction videos inviting new audiences to his music. You know what I'm saying for independent artists you need all the exposure that you need. I just, I just, I just love this part. They tried to tell me that I wasn't built for fame. Fast forward to when I'm paid. I ain't spent a dollar on the f***ing chain. I'll get my mama house. I'll get my dad a car. I'll make my sister rich. She'll never work again. Let's this go. It's so underwhelming. I'm conditioned for all the abuse. He say it's so underwhelming. I'm conditioned for all the abuse. I mean, think about what he's been through in his life. You know what I'm saying? It ain't, it ain't nothing for these comments and hate comments and stuff that he's getting. And like, it ain't really nothing for him to, you know what I'm saying? Based off what he's been through. 
seeing the reaction videos all blowing up and you're welcome for all of the views blow up my twitter y'all just keep making me bigger y'all yep. just keep showing you triggered right keep missing the point and I he said y'all keep <laughs> making me bigger y'all just keep blowing the trigger keep doing me blow up my twitter y'all just keep making me bigger y'all just keep showing you triggered y'all just keep missing the point and i keep doing me y'all ain't nothing to even consider man uh, i built this he, he not even house. worried or he not even worried about y'all man he not even worried about y'all, man. Look at his success. Making music with a purpose. You the kind of people that be hating on the surface. He on a whole Jenner, different man. um rhyme, not even a rhyme pattern, just a different flow pattern right now. So he's he's shifting the paces. He's he's talking and then he just rapping, rapping. And I built this f***ing house. I'm the kind of person making music with a purpose. You the kind of people that be hating on the surface. I'm the kind of you ain't used to, the kind of make you nervous. Yeah. Mm. Man, before I even wrote the record, I can see this coming like a fortune teller. A Ooh, I can see this coming like a fortune teller. I like the way he... I like the way he rhymed that, but it's also just the, just the uh, the delivery. And I spoke about his delivery in the um, best rapper ever. It's all is it's enough to if you you can have multi syllables, you'd be great at syllables. But if you ain't got no delivery or no enunciation to be able to deliver those words, you're not gonna get it. A calm sea don't make a skilled sailor, so I thank the heavens for a the calm sea don't make a still sailor. Well, that made me think about Lieutenant Dan for some reason. Stormy weather. Okay, fast forward to when we're old and gray. I'll be looking back at when they posted hate and it will hurt. Uh, old and gray. Look at old and gray post. Post, what is it? Old and gray. Thank the heavens for the stormy weather. Okay, fast forward to when we're old and gray. I'll be looking back at when they posted hate and it will hurt a bit, but it was worth it when your dream is getting hurt no matter what they say. I uh. try conveying that I love us all. And the way I did it left them so appalled. I used a broken arm to try and break their walls. No matter what they say, they know it took balls. I he see he used a he see he said he used a broken arm to punch the wall and he Oh look I'm the way I did it left him so appalled I used a broken arm to try and break their walls no matter what they say they know it took balls mm, no matter what they say it took balls I surveyed the land and I found a location unloaded the lumber and pounded the stakes and I what they say they know it took balls I surveyed the land and I found a location unloaded I surveyed the land and I found a location the lumber and pounded the stakes and I uh, served the lumber and pounded the paste. I ah. the bones of the people who hated with blood. I buried the bones of people who hated. See, I, I'm mumbling now. I did it, left them so appalled. <laughs> I used a broken arm to try and break their walls. No matter what they say, they know it took balls. I surveyed the land and I found a location. I surveyed the land and found a location. I loaded the lumber and pounded the stakes in. He said, I loaded the lumber and found, pounded the stakes in. And I blended the bones of the people who hated. I blended the bones of people who hated. With blood and cement, then I poured the foundation. I poured the blood. I poured the cement. Something said foundation. I got it. And I built the frame with all my guilt and shame, and then I, I built the frame with all my guilt and shame. I chiseled my name and the date in the basement. I carved my initials and all of the boards and the beams that are needed for structural greatness. No record label, no distribution. No. Mm, he's literally talking about building a house. He's saying that he built his own house. No cosign, no publicist, no manager, no teammates, no money to make up my budget with, no groceries, no studio, no booking agent, no bucket list, no P. Now you notice how the lightning and his silhouette are kinda on the same beat. Are kinda on beat. But it's uh it's given this instance of like uh life and pulsating. Um I like the way Nova like she's a genius, man. I gotta give a shout out to her. Um, can label no distribution, no cosign, no publicist, no manager, no teammates, no money. Now look, now you hear, you hear, you hear how the beat is like do 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 do, and then you see the silhouette, and then you see the lightning in the back. Trying to figure out, I'm still trying to figure out what exactly the imagery means, but I'm not gonna dwell on it right now. I will probably say it in the comments when I figure it out. Let me know in the comments what you think this whole part means to you. I need to make up my budget with no groceries. Uh, now nah, look, like when he said dun 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 dun, I notice how the change in the background goes. There's no studio, no booking agent, no bucket list, no PR, no marketing, just fans. Man, just fans. Hog life. Let's go. We built this f***ing house where my days end and it's vacant and they bury. My days end and it's vacant. Fans. Let's go. Man, we built this. House when my days end and it's vacant, and they bury me with that only key. My biggest fans gonna break in with a uh, weed. My biggest box. fans gonna break in. in. They'll say in, try to bring me back from that wooden box. They'll try to fill my grave with, and they'll sit on the roof with the rifles I hid in the fridge, and they'll shoot at the men on the roof. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Like, dude, hold up. No cap. I'm enjoying this. I just, his, I'm gonna tell you why. 
I get so giddy, you know what I'm saying? Um, Cause it, that's not fate. I, I love multis in, in a fast paced flow. That's kind of like what makes my hair stand up. You know what I'm saying? I love like, but when you add syllables and delivery into that, man, that just, it just, uh, it gets with a Ouija board and a box of chocolate and they bury me with that. Man, we built this house when my days end and it's fake and they bury me with that only key. My biggest fans gonna break in with a Ouija board and a box of chalk drop pentagram. Hail Satan. Ouija board. Pentagram hail. Ooh. My biggest fans gonna break in with a Ouija board and a box of chalk drop. Pentagram hail Satan. Try to bring me back from that wooden box. Y'all tried to fill my, my grave in. I'll sit on the roof with the rifles I hid in the fridge and they'll shoot at the men on the ridge who are coming to undo the work that I did. Then they'll block off the highway that leads to the crib and put sensors on all of the boards and the bridge so they know when they're coming to empty the clip. Dude, how? Wait a minute. How do you show this skill, tell a linear story, and have and make a whole verse as a metaphor? He's literally addressing people using the metaphor of building a house. Then I'll sit on the roof with the rifles I hid in the fridge and they'll shoot at the men on the ridge who are coming to undo the work that I did. Now he's saying he got people on. He's saying I'm going to sit on the roof of the house and shoot the people coming over the ridge trying to hate on them. Then they'll block off the highway that leads to the crib and put sensors on all of the boards and the bridge. He's saying, he's saying I'm putting sensors in security. He building it. Now he's at first. Now remember. At first, he built the foundation. Then he talked about building a foundation. Now he's talking about adding security to the house. When from the time he started talking about shooting people on the roof that's coming over the ridge, that's security. They're coming to empty the clip, then they'll cut all the bodies and cut off the skin. They connect all the pieces with needles and pins and attach it to 10 feet of branches and twigs and then plant it in mud till it stands in the wind. Then they'll stand there and look at this that we did that we never imagined we do because of them. Our blood and sweat. Mmm, bro, that, bro. Could, could he have done that in one whole breath? I want to know if he could do this in one whole It's funny because he kind of his silhouette kind of looks like an Indian, but I ain't gonna... attach it to ten feet of branches and twigs and then plant it in. You know, saying like you know how we talked about like him having such a uh, vivid imagination and being able to build his songs with words and stuff like that and having imagery. You know what I'm saying? So when you see me kind of doing this, and I'm like looking, I'm like I'm actually trying to build that picture that he's saying. I can I can definitely. Um, see what he's talking about and that's so important with building a song and i know how a lot of you guys enjoy this song it's one of your favorite songs but i want you to appreciate the picture i wish there was an artist out there that could um speed draw maybe like a speed draw of everything he's talking about bodies and cut off the skin they connect all the pieces with needles and pins and attach it to 10 feet of branches and twigs and then plant it in mud till it stands in the wind and they'll stand there and look at this that we did that we never imagined we do because of them our blood uh. and tears went into what we built till we were bags so we use imagine we do because the twigs and then it's funny because he'll have like these um uh eight to twelve bars uh rhyme schemes he'll have these eight to twelve bar rhyme schemes and then i notice sometimes he kind of changes the beat just to change the pace. So what really keeps your attention, like when watching Tom, is really just, man, how is he gonna keep, how are you gonna change the pace in this song? He start the song off slow, then he go fast, then he go slow, then he goes like a meteor speed, and then he raps super fast. Versatility, versatility. If this song was in a mumble rap flow, I probably would have cut it off maybe halfway through. You know what I'm saying? I, I like how, you know what I'm saying, as artists and rappers, we got to show the depths of our skill level. You know what I'm saying? People appreciate skill. There's a reason why Michael Jordan is the greatest right now. In this time, in the last 40 to 50 years, Michael Jordan is the greatest because we watched him be great. You know what I'm saying? So I want y'all to appreciate 
Appreciate Tom's music. Appreciate Tom's videos. Appreciate Evans mixing. Appreciate Nova's video production because we sitting up here. We watching true artistry at work. Appreciate Tom's lyrics, man. That's what I'm here for. Anytime I do a reaction to somebody, I want to I wanna bring appreciation to that artist and their skill level and all the hard work that they put into it. Didn't mud till it stands in the wind and I'll stand there and look at this shit that we did that we never imagined we do because of them. Our blood and sweat and tears went into what we built till we were bags. So we used blood and sweat and tears of enemies to build our flag. We built oh, so that's what he was talking about before when he was talking about putting the skin and needles and pins and standing standing them up in the wind and paying looking at what we did he was saying he was using the enemies <laughs> that's cold this house we laid these bricks we set these traps these flames we lit our haters he said we built this house we built these traps we built these flames and gasoline they brought to try and torture us with <laughs> let them hate dog everyone will have something to say dog their opinions don't mean trying to judge your engine by your paint job mm. I, this, I think somebody commented that very, very bar right there on one of the videos. You don't know the engine by the paint job. I got an Oldsmobile with a great engine, but look like trash on the outside. One will have something to say, dog. Their opinions don't mean trying to judge your engine by your paint job. Gravestone trying to machine. judge your engine by your paint job. Death. There's too much I ain't seen yet. They think that I got them way over my head, but I feel like I just got my feet wet. We're trying to dream more and sleep less. Avoid the pills when we're depressed. Remember to not be too hard on ourselves. If we cut deep enough, we up the bread, man. Mm. What do you guys think about that? Don't be too hard on ourselves. Remember that we bleed red. Avoid the pills when we're depressed. Avoid the pills when we're depressed. You know what I'm saying? People just want to drown out and not really confront what they're going through. Remember to not be too hard on ourselves. If we cut deep enough, we up the bread, man. You never know when it's time to go. Heaven's open when the bars are closed. So cease the... Heaven's open when the bars are closed. Nice one. Moment, don't leave it hoping. You'll breathe tomorrow. You can be a ghost. I'm living my life. The finish line is right in front of me. Made a fishing wire, so I'll never see it till it's too late. When God shakes my hand, please celebrate. Please. Mm. In front of me. Yeah, he does. Moment. You know what I'm saying? I noticed a lot of y'all saying that he believes in a higher power. I think he does too. Don't leave it hoping you'll breathe tomorrow. You could be a ghost. I'm living my life. The finish line is right in front of me. Made a fishing wire, so I'll never see it till it's too late. When God shakes my hand, please celebrate. Please celebrate. Please celebrate. Please celebrate. That's cold. I like that. Dang at the end. I want to I want to clap it up for the video production, Tom's words. We're literally a lot of people are name a song this house and it'd be nothing about a house. The for the simple fact that he's able to be so bar heavy, spit punchlines in actuality, he's building a house on everything that he's saying. First verse, building a foundation. Second verse, building up security. Third third verse, ammo, shooting the enemies. That was a bar. You know, I rhyme. You know, don't play it to hate the game. Bars. But, you know what I'm saying? Like, this song right here, yeah. This is a definite better response than I would than I would probably put together myself. You know what I'm saying? Like, you, you have to sometimes remind these people, especially if they haven't been around, especially if they just watched uh, White Boy and just thought this these things about. He got to remind these people who he is and what he built, you know what I'm saying? So it ain't it ain't nothing to do this. Um, it ain't nothing to do this, but let me tell you who I am, you know what I'm saying? And I noticed that um that kind of grows repetitively in the songs. He has to always address the haters and um make people um understand who he is. And sometimes you have to do that, you know what I'm saying? Play defense. Sometimes the best defense is the best offense, man. And I catch y'all later, man. Make sure you guys hit the like button and subscribe. Hey, we can do this all night. You know what I'm saying? Let's hit that 5K. I'll holler at y'all later. Hog Life family. Mug Tech, we in that thing. Peace.